Okay, we're here today with Bill Kazmaier here in Manila in the Philippines for World's Strongest Man 2018. Great to be here. Um, what's your role here in 2018? What are you doing here? Well, I'm here to have a good time. Yep. I'm searching for, uh, you know, I judge every trip by its food, and this is fantastic. We get langoustines and lobsters. And, okay. You know, some really nice curries. That's the reason I'm here, but yeah, as a sideline, I'm doing the SPD behind the scenes. Okay, brilliant. Yeah, and we, I saw one of your videos the other day with Terry Hollands, where you're getting into uh, questions from people on Facebook and asking yeah, them. Yeah, there's only so much that we can show yeah. along the way that that doesn't give away the show. Yeah. That's kind of one of the basic premises. So today I'll cut a bunch of stuff on each of the athletes. Yeah. But what they've won, where they've been, their size, what their aptitudes are, their strengths and maybe weaknesses and uh, bring some of that uh, to light before the show airs Absolutely. in America, I believe, June and then yep. at the end of the year uh, in UK. Okay, that's so. cool. So as a former athlete, you've won World's Strongest Man three times. Do you look at these guys competing and sometimes go, oh, I wish I was doing it? Well, I don't know. That was, yeah. I was in my prime in the early 80s. In the late 80s when I was finally invited back. Yep. It really wasn't fun and I really wasn't came out of wrestling with a torn tricep and a rupture. Ouch. Yep. And uh, eight weeks after the surgery, I went back and beat all the top guys, Higgins and, and Reeves and uh, John Paul and Capes. Yep. And I was a gimp. And that yes. was pectoral torn off, deltoid bicep, yep. tricep torn off. And they still couldn't beat the old beat up cast. But, so that was just kind of fun stuff, but it was all, it wasn't nice. It wasn't fair. And so when I retired in, uh, 89, 90, 90, I won five international shows. Yep. I said, OD, you and I have been traveling doing these team things. I'm going to let them screw you. I'm going to let you yep. go to the Worlds. And of course, you <laughs> saw what happened. Yeah, he absolutely. was leading by a huge margin. He was, was that the uh, the brick carry? Yeah. Yep, the famous brick carry, yep. But if you look at the anvil lift, he smoked everybody. And he was so, so strong. And it was a shame then. And, you know, it's, that's just the way uh, when you let some guys organize the event. Yeah. Sometimes it's... Uh, not quite so fair. But for this event, it's come a long ways. Mm. And would I want to compete? I've always wanted to compete against the Druids. Yep. But, uh, you know, the athletes are 100 pounds heavier. Who's your favorite athlete? Uh, well, I have the argument with see through time as to who's the strongest ever. Yep. And it ends up being like two eight year old boys in the garden who are best friends yeah. and telling each other that they're the best. Yep. So when I tell him that he's the best, he says, well, you're my favorite. And you say, you're the best. Yep. It's like uh, great respect there. You know, he doesn't have too many more years left. Hopefully he does really well on the show and can yeah. maybe hang it up. He's got a few nicks in the armor. He's a great old warrior. Yeah, absolutely. He always finds a way to make the finals. And, you know, even last year, uh, making the final and then taking last. It was really a shame to see. A great warrior like him, but he, you know, he's, he's he's got a got a lot of honor. Yeah, he definitely has. And I, and I was talking to Lawrence Charlie the other day, and Lawrence made the point that he beat Z a couple of times, and he felt sad afterwards. What? To the buffet? <laughs> I might have been the buffet. Yeah. I must admit, Z apparently likes the cheese platter here in the Philippines. That's one of his favorites. I've heard. Well, it is an amazing spread of food. It's literally uh, ten different bars of anything, everything you can think of, as well as uh, ice cream at the end. Yeah. So. No, that's awesome. Well, thank you for everything that you've actually done for the school, and we can. Well, yeah. we hope to continue seeing you on the scene for a long time. Thanks. This year is going to be really exciting. Yeah. Stay tuned. We'll do. Thank you.